Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and last night we went out and did some mining, so I got some uh, iron and lead and stuff cooking up there. I've got some iron plating cooking up there. And yeah, so that's pretty much what we did. So we are going to go out and about and continue questing and continue building up our research data. We have 1,200, so we need 800 more in order to make the gasoline, excuse me, gasoline can schematic. Uh, so let's see. I had one point last night, and I put that point into, what did we put it into? We put it into lockpicking level two. So now we can handle, uh, basically lockpicking is now at 50 or plus 50, so we have, I guess, 75 lockpicking now. And um, I'm not sure exactly what that gets us, but uh, we're going to max that out. Not so much for, you know, for accessibility, because we can, you know, pop the jailbreakers for that, but just for durability, because, you know, as we put points into that, our lockpicking durability, so this added 40% uh, more durability uh, to the lockpicks. Okay, so that's what we did there, and yeah, so we already got the quest. Let's head on down, grab our bicycle. I don't know why I just dropped my sledgehammer. Uh, I was trying to turn my light on, and I dropped the sledgehammer. So yeah, don't ask me why. I don't know why. It just happened. Is there anything in here? No, that's empty. All right. Let's get on the bike and get the hell out of Dodge. These guys are beating me up. Oh, mother... F they, they infected me, man. All right, whatever. So, yeah, I'll see you guys over at the quest. This is a retreat, the supplies quest. We're going to just keep pounding these out for Trader Joel so we can get him up to level four, or tier four, rather, just like the uh, Trader Hugh is in the other wasteland town, and then, you know, just kind of keep going from there. But oh, our overriding goal is to get to those research data. So I will see you over at the place. All righty, we are at our quest location. I, you know what, I'm not so sure that I have uh, done this in Alpha 20. In fact, I haven't because it has changed from what it used to be. So let's do our our prerequisite double looting here. And that's a nice find. Yeah, we will take that. We'll check the uh, Mo Power utility van here. All right, there we go. There's some research data. Got a 4x4 Jeep. That's a nice find. Ice breaker, uh, breaker rather, pickaxe. How does that compare to our steel? Our steel is still a little bit better. Okay, well, then we'll probably just end up selling that. A little bit of glue action there. Ooh, is there some fuel in this? There is. Look at that. Let's get some fuel. Nice. Any more fuel around here? There's a little bit of oil shale that we can dig up at some point. But hopefully, you know, like I said, we won't uh, have to worry too much about this too much longer because we are going to start making our own gasoline. All right, let's grab a little bit of meat for dinner. Now, is there anything else we can double loot before we start the quest? Yeah, we got a, a box here. Let's hit that real quick. Maybe we'll actually find some um, uh, some fuel in here, too. All right, nice. We got a saw and some parts, motor tool parts. Okay, let's do this for realsies. That is not a lootable car now. Check Mo Power again. Spike trap. Uh, be nice to know that it would indeed. That's like iron spikes too. But you know what? I think I would rather have the research data at this point. So that's what we're gonna do. A little bit of copper action. Okay. So what is this? This is a retrieve quest. So we don't have to kill everything. Looks like there's probably going to be some Zeeks in those closets over there. I'm curious to see how this has changed because I never... Oh, nice. I never actually did this in Alpha 20, so... Okay, we got a dude in there. Actually, hold on. Let's see if we can get a headshot off on him. But I also want to see if... Yeah. Well, so much for that idea, huh? Got 
Down with the sickness. Down with that sickness. Whoa, shit. Down with that sickness. Okay, when I say down with the sickness, that means you need to go down on the ground and die. There you go. There you go. Hey, pain resistance has improved to level 29. Look at us in our bad selves. Let's check this and see what we got going on. Anybody in here? Nope. Anybody in behind these? Nope. Those are not normal uh, breakout panels for the Zombos to come and get us. Grab all of that stuff there. Uh, all right. So I think, I guess it wants us to go through here. That would appear to be the case. Let's grab this chair here. Get the leather and the mechanical parts and all that good stuff from that. I know I can hit uh, these guys for elect electrical parts, but we'll do that later. Let's see what's going on down here. All right, I see a Zeke up there and a Zeke up there. Let's see if we can sniper doodle this guy. He's been sniper doodled. Let's wake that guy up, but then run back up here. And okay, he's dead. He did, I think. No, 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 no. Don't be doing that shit. Oh, they just took the door out. All right, this is too many guys. Give me your heads. All right, there we go. That was a lot of Zika Roos. Now, there used to be a thingy up here. Is there still? Whoopsie. Try that again. Yeah, there's a little bag up here. And this little passageway is new. This was not in the game before Alpha 20. We got some box here. Boxes, rather. Nothing back that way. There's our satchel right there. Beautiful. Okay, let's grab the light. And now we're just looking for fat loots. Okay, we got this here. Let's get some, uh, get another light and some bricks because we can. Lots of electrical thingy-madoodles that we can take apart down here for the parts. When the di when the if and when the time comes that we need a bunch of those. Okay, we got a box here with glass in it. Yeah, that's exactly what we want. You know what? We do need sand, though. We do need sand. Here, have a wrench. Okay, have a sledgehammer instead. I hear a dog. Is that dog up above? He must be. All right, so what exactly do we get from this? Yeah, electric parts, pipes, scrap iron. All good. Okay. Ooh, we can take this part. Yeah, that dog must be upstairs. This area down here. Oh, look, we got our one of our first greenies. I have a... Oh, man, he hits hard. I have a rad remover mod uh, in the this weapon here. Here, we better take couple of these I think a couple of my weapons have rad remover mods let's take a look and see who has one uh, you do not you the okay the shotgun has one and the AUC has one. Oh, and the saw blade too okay good all right what'd you drop man nice I'll take the research data baby Okay, we got a Mo Power box in here. We have more research data. Scrap that. What is this? Drone morale booster. Reading this command will teach you to craft this item. Doesn't this? I think this thing gives us like um, health over time. Why don't we learn that? Because we are going to do drones. It is definitely my plans 
to do drones in this series. And that, that stuff's kind of rare. I mean, that's the first time I've seen that. So we're going to take it. All right. That takes care of all that stuff. Oh, we never did do the thingy here. All right. Let's check this. Some zombies came out of here. All right. We got some concrete in here. Some boxes we can check. Anything back there? Uh-uh. All right, let's get this concrete. I guess we'll harvest that thing too. All right, let's go up this way. Oh shit, feral big boy. Big boy's gonna take this down like faster than you know even know, man. Unless we can keep him stun locked, which yeah, didn't work so well, did it? That guy scares the hell out of me. I'm kidding you not, man. He hits so hard and he's so damn tough. Whew, okay. There's a person here. Shut up, dog. Okay, so let's see. We had we are we're finished in here. We started going upstairs, right? Okay. Uh, why don't we take one more of these? This is where we ran into all these Zeeks. Looks like that dog is working on the thing there. Lots of stuff for us to take apart. Let's check this. I like to see these new these new POIs because they're the same, but they're not the same, you know? Let's see what the differences are and stuff. Oh, look at that. Three charges of mineral water. We'll take it. Thank you very much. Uh, let's also get this paper. And what the hell, we'll do the light too. Nothing there. Okay. Uh, I will maybe come back and salvage this stuff later. I probably won't, but I might. You never know. Oh my god. Okay. Where'd you come from? Oh, our helmet's broken. All right, we're going to have to fix that when we get back to the base. Uh, looks like we found the fat loot's room. Let's open up the mo power. Tech Junkie! We are scrapping these for data points. Okay, and we have two more charges of mineral water. All right, why don't we do this? Let's um, drink some mineral water because we're actually thirsty. And then we can get that other charge. That's nice. Is that a, an upgrade from what we're currently using? It is. There you go. Time for the fat loots. Oh, look at that, baby. And a treasure map. And 44 rounds. Damn. All right. Uh, now, I've got some purple lever action rifles back at the base, so we're going to have to compare the damage on this to those to see which one's actually better. Uh, but that was a very nice find. No doubt about it. Why don't we wait until we get back to our base to read that so it's kind of centered off of our base. Uh, oh, we got more stuff back here. Look at this. Savage country. Spear hunter scrapping, getting that research data, man. Getting that research data. Okay, 
Uh, so that was the fat loots. Let's just run up here and just see what's up here. Probably buzzards. Um, nope, just a Steve. A Steve, a bird's nest, some of that stuff, some of this stuff, and some of this stuff. Is that anything? No. Anything up here? Nope. Okay, cool. That was fun. Like I said, uh, it's a little little different than it used to be, but still also quite familiar. So I'm liking it. I am liking it. All right, let's go back to try to do our turning. All right, we're going to buy some peas. We're going to buy some salmon because we can make the um, thingamadoodles. Uh, let's buy some of those canned dog food. I think we're going to hold off on nerd tats, chicken ration, beef. Yeah, well, we need the beef. Okay, we'll leave the rest of that in there. You don't look so good. Here is your reward. Okay, once again, we get shit rewards. Um, but, you know, it is what it is, right? I guess we'll take the claw hammer. Oh, now we're done. All right, so we got a farm bundle, a melee mods bundle, 5,000 coin or a workbench. Uh, you know what? Well, I'm going to take the farm bundle because I took that last time and it's just slowly building up our farm. Um, I think that's, I mean, 5,000 dukes is, is nice too, but we're going to take the farm bundle. All right. Now, uh, special jobs, opening trade routes, you, trader gin. That's I'm sure we already speed. have unlocked that trader gin, but we'll take it anyway because we can. And then, uh, the next time we come here, this dude's going to give us tier two jobs. Let's take a look at your inventory. Do you have new stuff since the last time we looked? It kind of looks like you do maybe. All right. So what do you have? Nothing super great there. What about in your secret stash? Fireman's Almanac. What does this do? Reduce chance to be lit on fire by 25%. Drone cargo extender. Hmm. Um, maybe? Should we? How much money do I have? Well, I got lots of money back at the base in addition to what's here. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to sure. do it. All right, let's go back to you. Look at your inventory. All right, archery, pumpkin bread. Do, 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 do. You got a AUC, but not, not as good as the one we have. Okay, nothing super great there. Magnum Enforcer. You can craft high power 44 Magnum. Ooh, look at this. That's kind of tempting, guys. I have not come across any... I mean, not even one in this entire playthrough have I come across one uh, of the blue and white antibiotics. And I haven't come across the schematic either, obviously, right? I think we should buy this. I really do. We're going to do it. Watch me, watch me find one now. Uh, okay, the rest of this stuff come back sometime. is good. All right, so we are going to learn both of these. And let's open this, and that just gives us all that stuff But the farm plots. Okay, cool. Uh, all right, so here's the deal. I'm not going to take any more quests from these guys until tomorrow because of the fact that tomorrow we'll be able to get Tier 3s from them, or from Joel anyways. And let's see, it's 9.49 in the morning. Why don't we go back to the base, drop some stuff off, and let's do some random looting we haven't really done any random looting to speak of in the wasteland so far and i think we'll do that uh so yeah i will uh go do that i'm gonna go drop stuff off i'll choose a place to random loot and when that decision is made i'll bring you guys back and we'll randomly loot someplace we'll probably do someplace close to our base all right guys i am back and i have some bad news bad news is that i did the usual thing where I thought I was recording, and I wasn't, and we went through an entire POI, um, and I, went, I didn't record it. Oh, it's so frustrating. So, well, the uh, POI that we did uh, was right uh, outside of our, or right across the road from our base. Um, so, I'll take you back there and just kind of show you... Uh, you know what it was anyways and uh, hopefully there's a fairly decent chance because it was a tier 4 POI actually uh, that we will be able to do that one again as a trader quest or even you know find it somewhere else um, but I'm just kind of out 
doing a, a little more basic looting here, or random looting, I should say, uh, before the night's over. Uh, so let me, and it was, I was going after, um, oh shit, I was going after, um, whatchamacallit, uh, some corn and potatoes, you know, some farming stuff. And, uh, realized, you know, uh, in the process of doing this that I hadn't actually recorded that whole last sesh, which really sucks. But it does happen on occasion. Uh, and I thought about just scrapping the whole thing and starting over, but I don't really want to because, you know, we made really good progress. So hopefully you guys will take my word for it that I didn't cheat or anything like that. <clears throat> but what we got uh, out of that run was this B-level Ranger rifle. Uh, which is actually better than the blue sniper rifle that we found. And uh, we found a couple other pretty nice things, too. And uh, with the two research data that I just now got, we now have enough research data finally to make the gasoline. So, uh, yeah. And that was that's pretty much what happened. You know, we found, a, you know, a couple other, you know, nice-ish pieces, too. I just don't remember off the top of my head what they were. But, again, I apologize, guys. I try not to... I definitely didn't mean to run through that whole thing without recording. Thought that I was recording it, but I wasn't, and sometimes it happens. So, anyway, we'll move on. Um, so, let's go back to the base, because it is getting on in the day. And I'll just kind of show you the POI that we did. Looks like we have a Zombo drop uh, over there, too. One thing I really like about Undead Legacy is you can you can see those drops from a long ways off. So, Subquakes made that... Uh, uh, pretty cool that we can do that. All right, so yeah, that's some nice basic stuff there. We'll take it. So yeah, we basically did this POI right here. So the Zip Coffee, the Cracker Book, and the Hearts Rent-A-Car. Uh, so we went through this whole POI here, and um, there wasn't a whole ton of books in here, but there was a few that we got uh, out of this place. And then uh, the Rent-A-Car place is in here. This is where the, the fat loots is at the end here. So we got all that stuff out of there. And it was a pretty uh, intense fight. You know, you know, it's a tier four POI. And uh, we ran into a lot of ferals and a lot of cops and stuff, but we managed to do it without dying. And uh, it was fun. So again, uh, we'll either find another one of these to do in the future, or we'll get it, you know, as a quest. And, you know, for like, say this one, oh, I was going to actually come back here and take this apart. And that way we can reset this one and then do it again uh, legit. So anyway, that's pretty much what happened. And again, sorry about that. What we're going to do is we're going to go back to the base, though, for the rest of this episode. Since it's, you know, I don't really want to do this at night. We probably will do some, uh, you know, looting at night at some point. But I want to be just a little stronger than I currently am before we really start doing that. Oh, there was like a little secret area back here, too, that I didn't get to. Um, so let's get back to the base, and then what we're going to do is we're going to uh, make that, uh, make the the gas tank that we've been wanting to make for a million years. Oh, wrenching that unlocks it? I didn't know that. Wow. Okay, well, that is very good to know. Get out of here, you two. And you three. Anybody else? You want some too? All right, there you go. You guys all done? Are we done? Are we done? Okay. Man, this is hat. You know, being able to get the gas matic is happening none too soon too, because this bicycle is uh, almost broken, and I don't even know the bicycle repair kit to repair it. So uh, we don't. You know, I don't, and I don't want to spend research data to learn it, right? So. Yeah, like I said, it's happening right at a good time here. So let's just run over here. We got a ball sack there. Is he feral? Well, it doesn't matter. He's coming after us now. No, he's not. All right. Let's kill his ass. Now, I don't know what we need to... Well, actually, I don't think we need anything to make the gas cans other than just uh, oil shell and an empty gas can. So we just need to make the schematic, and we should be good to go. I'm hoping that's all it's going to take because, man, this has been a long time coming, I'll tell you what. A long time coming. 
Uh, Subquake has not made it easy to get gasoline uh, in quantity in this mod. And I'm not complaining about that. I'm, I'm down with it, man. It's just the way the mod works. Everything's harder to get, but in a good way, in a satisfying way once you do, you know, finally manage to, to make it work. So I'm not complaining. I'm just pointing out that it is a struggle in this mod for that sort of thing. Uh, okay, so let's grab all of this research data. And let's see, we're going to need 100 uh, oil shale. So we'll just grab 153 of those. Uh, we've got acid in here. Five precisely. I've got a, a beaker upstairs, and we should have 10 books in here. And alcohol should be upstairs, too. Now we can get back to our motorcycle, you guys. Um, it's going to be so nice. So let's research this sucker. There it goes. Woo -hee. How long has it been? <laughs> How long has it been since we've been waiting to be able to do this? Oh, my goodness. I don't know if you can find these out in the world, but I, sure, I certainly never found them, you know. So very cool. All right. So we can finally make gasoline. Thank the Lord for that. All right, let's go put a couple things away while we're waiting for that to finish up. And then we will start making some gas. Uh, we, uh, we're going to have to make a trip to the uh, to the desert next. Um, and we have an opening trade routes that way anyways, uh, one of the trader gens. So we're going to go get a crap ton of oil shale, bring it back, and then make a crap ton of gasoline. We have in here, I've got 13 cans plus this one. So that should make us a nice batch of gasoline and last us for quite some time. Let's get this stuff put away here. Get this stuff put away in here. Uh, I, I got so much more crap that I still need to sell. I mean, this this is supposed to be the parts and mods bin, but, it, you know, I've had to overflow weapons into here. This is completely full of weapons. Um, I've the This is full of tools. This is full of tools. This is starting, you know, we started to put tools in there now, too including these guys so yeah but the, you know this the thing that's holding me up on that of course is not having the resources to repair all of that stuff and of course we don't want to sell it till we can repair it because we'll get a lot more money so yeah but we'll get to it eventually we will get to it eventually let's uh, do a sort there um we can put the book in paper or well the book anyways in there and the paper can go in the ammo box the rest of that goes upstairs, except for, of course, the bicycle. Okay, let's get this thing. Baby, you are like gold. Yes, you are. Uh, I'm keeping that lockpick in there because I'm going <clears> to <throat> uh, research lockpicks. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we can finally make gasoline. Oh, my goodness. What a long time coming that was. Okay, so let's see. I came down here to put this in here because we don't need to take that with this. This can go in here. And uh, didn't I already? I must not have dropped all that stuff off. Okay, so this is the Kim bench uh, to make gasoline. Oh, we need coal powder. Really? That's interesting. Okay, well, I'm out of coal. <laughs> I need coal for other stuff too, of course. So tomorrow, um, you know what? Actually, I think what I might end up doing is I might go into the forest because I've, you know, I've got some coal mines marked here in the forest. I have not come across it in the in the wasteland yet, uh, nor have I tapped into it down in my mine. Here, we don't need that anymore. I've already gotten that. So I might go into the forest at nighttime and just mine some coal. And while we're there, you know, we'll hit some bird's nests and some stumps for honey, that sort of thing, too. And then in the morning, what we'll do, we'll stop by this gin here just to open that trade route. And then we'll scooch up to the desert and find um, a nice deposit of oil shale. And then we'll just mine that crap out of some oil shale. So I think that's going to be the plan uh, moving forward. So I'll do the coal mining at night and then in the morning... Um, we'll uh, i'll probably maybe meet you guys in the desert to start the episode and we'll and we'll start some mining uh there and then yeah go from there and then we'll be doing the motorcycle from here on out guys until we get you know even a better vehicle we'll also be able to start using the valkyrie drill the chainsaw all that too because now i can make gasoline and it's a beautiful feeling all right i'm gonna let you guys go here i hope you guys enjoyed the episode again i apologize guys for missing all of that footage you know shit happens sometimes and it's just the way it goes can't do anything about it uh, I didn't want to start it all over because 
it, it's just it's too much progress lost. And uh, so hope everybody's cool with that. It is what it is. And uh, oh, is that another drop down there? I think there's a drop right on the other side of that fountain, but it doesn't show up when I zoom in on the scope. So we'll have to go check that out. Uh, but anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share out the video. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.